This library video will show you how to use the Factiva database to find Australian and international newspaper articles. To locate Factiva from the library website, choose Resources, then E-Resources. Scroll down to the General Guides and then select News and Newspapers. You'll find the link to Factiva in the centre column. Access is restricted to three users at a time, so remember to log out when you're finished. Let's have a look. Enter your keywords into the free text search box. Use AND between keywords to retrieve results containing both words. Let's search for globalization and society. For keywords with alternative spellings, such as globalization, which can be spelt with an S or a Z, use the question mark wildcard so articles with both spellings are retrieved. Remember to use AND between any additional keywords. You can limit the results by date from in the last day to all dates or enter a date range. I'm going to limit our search to the last six months. You can also limit by source. The My Source List drop down menu allows you to limit by industry, language, region, title, or source type. For example, to search only newspapers, I will select by type and then scroll down and click on Newspapers All. Let's click on Search. On the Results page, click on the article title to read the full text. If you have too many or irrelevant results, select Modify Search. Let's only search a specific newspaper or group of newspapers. Click the triangle next to Source. Remove the newspapers all. Make sure My Source List has been selected. You can add a group by clicking on it. Or expand the selection to choose individual newspapers. Scroll down and click on each title you wish to include. To refine your search further, scroll down and choose More Options. Here you can change the search so the free text terms are searched in the headline and lead paragraph instead of the full article. Your results will now have the keywords in the headline and lead paragraph of the article. When you're done searching, log out by clicking on the cogwheel at the top right and select Log Out. Thank you for watching this video. For more information, please contact the library.